Hey guys, it's Sky here. So, welcome back to my channel. Um, I have not posted a YouTube video in so long, so this is gonna be kind of like a little life update, if you would say. So the reason why I have not been posting on YouTube is because I have not had a vlog camera. I got into a car accident literally last year. I had all my belongings in there, including my camera. And instead of giving my property back, they decided to throw all my property away, including my camera and it was like so many other things in that car so ever since july of last year i just never got my camera back i was vlogging on my iphone but as you could see i don't know if you guys can see but it's like cracked and then when i record it makes a sound listen so i know you guys don't want to hear that <laughs> in any of my youtube videos i'm literally gonna just do my skincare routine a little bit that is why i have not been posting on youtube but i promise you i am back permanently i will be posting i don't know what i'm gonna be posting yet well i kind of know just like regular stuff that i like to post with that being said i definitely missed you guys life has been great i've been traveling um you put guys already like why didn't you vlog that um i didn't have a camera and i did not want that sound in my videos so i just decided to not vlog and just wait and i should have ordered this camera like a while ago but i just didn't don't know why just didn't order the camera didn't feel like ordering the camera so and they're so expensive the cameras are like 600 700 dollars i didn't want to order the camera but i said you know what you guys keep asking me in my comments when a new youtube video is coming up so let me know what you guys want to see i can do a closet haul or um even like which what do you call it um like things that i've ordered recently and can show you guys i'm not gonna do a try on haul because that's too much work and i gotta get a tripod like a camera tripod that is tall that stands up so i can actually show you guys because i have in my upstairs bedroom it's like a whole um full closet so i have a lot of items in there and i can show you guys a lot of my favorite items that i have in my closet things that have been sitting there that i just don't wear um and all that stuff and just daily vlogs but i definitely have missed you guys um a lot i've definitely missed you guys a ton and you know what for this video, I'm going to ask you guys quickly to ask me some questions. I'm going to do it on Instagram really quickly. Just some life update questions. You guys can ask me anything. Someone said, how have you been mentally? Thank you for asking. This was asked by underscore dot Mora with two A's one. I have been doing really good mentally. Thank you for asking. I know a lot of people don't talk about mental health or they shy away from it. But that's just like a really important thing in my life. I have most definitely struggled with my mental health before. You go through a lot of trials and tribulations in life, which is normal, but it's all about how you handle them. And I've definitely like, whew, I've definitely gone through those, some things. But what helps me is I love to just hang out with my friends. I go to therapy. That's like one of my favorite things to do as well. I go to therapy, get advice and talk to somebody who isn't in my day Daily life or will just give me the answer that I want to hear just because they're my friend and whatnot but my mental health has most definitely been really good recently someone said what's your life goal short term um honestly just to be happy that's the goal in life I want to do a lot of things I never like to speak on what I want to do so I don't like to put it out into the air because I feel like when you tell people like what you want to do in your life or what your plans are when that time comes they're like so where's this 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 and that you said you were gonna do this and i just i don't know we'll see where life brings me that's all i can say we'll we'll see what opportunities i have and where life takes me but i'm most definitely excited for the things that i'm working on and all the things that i want to do how have you been lately i've been doing really good thank you for asking do i want a child you guys love asking me questions about kids please stop pushing kids on me i'm literally only 21 no i don't want kids when are you streaming on twitch again i need your guys help i need somebody in the twitch community or just somebody period to help me get a twitch setup like i don't know how to figure this out i don't know what a pc is 
I don't know what computer screens I need. I know I have a Sony, I think it's like the Sony Q7 camera. I have that, but I don't know what I need to stream because I want to do for my streams, like I'm not going to play video games. I want to do like reaction videos, talk to you guys, whatnot. But I don't know how to go about it. And then I'm so clueless, like I don't know how to set all that up. So please guys, someone in the comments, either message me on Instagram or leave your Instagram below and send me a breakdown. Nothing too crazy expensive, please. But a breakdown of like what I would need for PC wise. That's not crazy. Okay, you're just doing reaction videos, whatnot. This is what you need. I don't need things that are gonna cost me like thousands of dollars. A piece of advice for younger generations, I would say don't grow up too fast. You have plenty of time to live life. When you're 12, 13, 14, you don't need to look like you're 25. You don't need to have, there's no, you don't high expectations. You don't need to live up to expectations of what social media puts on a lot of people. <clears throat> I would just say live your life because I remember being 16 and I wanted to be grown so bad or even, um, I didn't even celebrate, like I didn't have like a real 16th birthday. I kind of just chilled, but I regret that now. Cause you're only 16 once. Like do what you want to do in life, but don't feel like you have to grow up too fast. That's what I would say. Cause I feel like a lot of younger girls feel like they have to. And that's only because people who are younger who have told me that from their perspective. But it has a lot to do with social media. So just act your age. There's no, no reason to grow up super fast, you know? Um, when is the daily life vlog gonna upload? Um, I don't know because it's not even recorded yet, but it's gonna be really soon. What's your main regret in life? I honestly don't have any regrets in life because I feel like if I haven't gone through what I've gone through or made the mistakes that I've made, um, I wouldn't be who I am today and it's definitely shaped me as a person. So I don't have any regrets. Will you ever live with your mom again? Um, no. <laughs> I say that because why would I um, move out just to go back, live, go back to living with my mom? Once you progress in life, you don't go back to where you were. But I do love my mom and I visit her a lot. She's not that far from me, so. I know, and I see her like three times a week. Recommend some Jamaican food for me to try if you eat Jamaican food. Okay, I love this place in California. It's called We Jammin. I just had it today. It is so good. I get um, stewed chicken, all white meat with a side of callaloo with a beef patty, rice and peas, and it's like this Jamaican ginger drink, like pineapple ginger. Super, super good, my favorite drink to have. But that's my meal and I get a large plate. I don't get a small, I get a large because I eat a lot. How often do you cook? Hmm. I used to cook a lot living at home with my mom, but I've been super, super busy lately um, to the point where I don't have time to cook. Like I don't, I probably only cooked maybe twice, maybe once since living in my new place. So it's kind of bad, but I've literally only cooked one time. What is my dream car? My dream car is a Lamborghini truck. That is my dream car and I want like um, a really pale baby pink color. I'm trying to find a picture of like what it looks like. But that is my dream car. Like I love lamb trucks. I've driven one before and it's like, drives so smooth. I love it. Pink lamb truck. It's probably not the pink you guys are thinking about. Like I want like a really soft pink lamb truck. Mm, that's kind of it. Maybe even a little bit more paler than this, but I want this car immediately. I need her immediately and I'll get her one day. I'm about to start freshman year of high school. Any advice? Worry about your education. Education comes first. Don't get yourself involved in the wrong crowds and don't do things just because um, you feel peer pressure to or like you want to be in a certain clique and whatnot. You don't have to impress anybody, you know? Focus on your schoolwork. That's most important because that's going to get you to the career that you want in life one day, depending on what that is. Um, and just, you're there to go to school. Like just go to school, go home, worry about your business. And that's all I could say is just stay focused on your education. What is my favorite food? I love 
love, love Jamaican food and seafood, like King Crab Legs. Three favorite makeup products. I love um, lip gloss, which I have on now. Mascara, a lot of you guys ask if my eyelashes are fake. I get that so much, like do you wear lash extensions? No, I literally don't. They're my real natural lashes and they're pretty long. So mascara and um, eyebrow gel. Those are like my three go-tos. Have I been eating good? I have been eating good. I've been trying to. How was the Barbie movie premiere? Oh, it was so much fun. And you guys already know why. Because I saw my queen, Nicki Minaj. That's why. I'm gonna insert a picture right here. But I am obsessed with her. Like, I love her. She smelled so good. I wanted to ask her, like, what was she wearing? Because it just smelled like a dream. Like, I don't even know how to describe it. But she just smelled so good. She's so beautiful in person. Like she's already pretty in pictures, but in person, if you see this this lady in person, it's like, oh my gosh. She literally has a perfect face. Like every side, angle, up, down, she is just perfect. So that's why I was just so excited. But of course I love the movie. I thought it was really fun. A show you're binge watching. I know this show is not new, but I have started from season one and I've kept going and that is Everybody Hates Chris. I don't know why I've been on the Everybody Hates Chris kick. Like, I just love that show all of a sudden. Like, I've been crying laughing. I didn't realize, I think it's when I came, when the show came out, I was young. So now, like, being able to understand the jokes and kind of relate to it, like, that show is just so funny. It will have me in tears. And my favorite character is Greg, the little, um, the white boy on the show. He is my favorite character because he's just, like, so always scared and nervous about everything. <laughs> I'm just like thinking about him in my head. And he's just so over the top, but I'm obsessed with his character. And of course, Chris. And then Tanya, on the other hand, I cannot stand Tanya. Just because she's always trying to rat out Chris and Drew. And it's like, girl, you're supposed to be a sister, not asking for like $2 to keep a secret just to then tell it anyways. Oh, Tanya just, oh my gosh. Who else? Drew, there's nothing wrong with Drew. He's like the perfect person. Everybody loves Drew. And, um, oh, Malvo, the guy who like robs every, <laughs> the guy who like robs everyone who's been after Chris. Oh my gosh. I don't know if you guys seen the episode where Malvo like gets out of prison and he wants to better his life and he wants Chris to help him go to school just to then go back and start robbing people again. I just can't with him. I can go on and on about the show all day, but definitely I've been binge watching Everybody Hates Chris. Uh, most, the most grateful experience you've had so far in life, most definitely visiting Kenya when I went to Kenya for about a week. Um, it just made me realize that a lot of people who have less than what I have and they are just so happy with what they have in life. I think it just kind of made me look at life differently and be more appreciative of what I have. So most definitely Kenya. Workout routine. I'll do a workout video. I go to the gym three days a week, so I will most definitely make a workout video. Um, this is gonna be my last question. What are my favorite things to do? I love to be home, be in the bed, be in my own space, mind me, myself, and I's business, and be with my dog. Those are my favorite things to do. But anyways, I love you guys so much. I'm gonna hurry up, try to get this video posted. It is July 31st. So let's see how long it takes me to get this video uploaded, but hopefully not too long. And I will see you guys in the next video. And I love you guys so much. Mwah. Comment down below what you guys wanna um, want me to do next on YouTube and what type of videos you guys want because I will do them and I'm being serious this time. Okay, my camera's about to die, so bye.